My name is Harry Jones, writer and curator of the African American Civil War Museum. Heritage by Conte Cullen. What is Africa to me? Copper sun, a scarlet sea? Jungle star, jungle track? Strong bronze men or regal black? Women from whose loins I sprang when the birds of Eden sang? One three centuries removed from the scenes his fathers loved. Spicy groove, cinnamon tree, what is Africa to me? So I lie who all day long want no sound except the song, sung by wild barbaric birds, goading massive jungle herds, juggernauts of flesh that pass, trampling tall defiant grass, where young forest lovers lie, plighting troth beneath the sky. So I lie, who always hear, though I cram against my ear, both my thumbs and leave them there, great drums throbbing through the air. So I lie, whose font of pride, dear distress and joy allied, is my somber flesh and skin, with the dark blood damned within, like great pulsing tides of wine, that I fear must burst the fine, channels of the chafing net, where they surge and foam and fret, Africa. A book one thumbs, listlessly till morning comes. Unremembered are her bats, circling through the night, her cats, stalking gentle flesh that feeds, crouching in the river reeds. By the river brink no more does the bugle throated roar, cry that monarch claws have leapt from the scabbards where they slept. Silver snakes that once a year doff the lovely coats you wear. Seek no covert in your fear, lest a mortal eye should see. What's your nakedness to me? Here no leprous flowers rear, fierce corollas in the air. Here no body sleek and wet, dripping mingling wane and sweat. Tread the savage measures of jungle boys and girls in love. What is last year's snow to me? Last year's anything, the tree. Budding yearly must forget how its past arose or set. Bow and blossom, flower fruit, even what shy bird with mute wonder at her travail there, meekly labored in its hair. One three centuries removed from the scenes his fathers loved, spicy groove, cinnamon tree, what is Africa to me? So I lie, who find no peace, night or day no slight release, from the unremittent beat made by cruel padded feet, walking through my body street, up and down they go and back, treading out a jungle track. So I lie, who never quite, safely sleep from rain at night. I can never rest at all when the rain begins to fall. Like a soul gone mad with pain, I must match its weird refrain. Ever must I twist and squirm, wreathing like a baited worm, while its primal measures drip through my body, crying, strip, doff this new exuberance, come and dance the lover's dance in an old remembered way. Rain works on me night and day. Quaint outlandish heathen gods, black men fashioned out of rods, clay and brittle bits of stone in a likeness like their own. My conversion came high priced. I belong to Jesus Christ, preacher of humility, heathen gods are not to me. Father, Son, and Holy Ghost, so I make an idle boast. Jesus of the twice turned cheek, Lamb of God, although I speak with my mouth thus in my heart, do I play a double part. Ever at thy glowing altar, must my heart grow sick and falter, wishing he I served were black, thinking then it would not lack precedent of pain to guide it. Let who would or might deride it. Surely then this flesh would know yours had borne a kindred woe. Lord, I fashion dark gods too, daring even to give you dark despairing features where, crowned with dark rebellious hair, patience wavers just so much as mortal grief compels while torches, quick and hot of anger rise to smitten cheek and weary eyes. Lord, forgive me if my need sometimes shapes a human creed all day long and all night through. One thing only must I do, quench my pride and cool my blood, lest I perish in the flood, lest a hidden ember set timber that I thought was wet, burning like the driest facts, melting like the merest wax, 
lest the grave restore its dead. Not yet has my heart or head in the least way realized they and I are civilized. <laughs>